right, so Sartag versus Picano here. We got a DX matchup here, Kurogunk versus Darkrai. to get the counterattack off. So okay, covering some vulnerables here. Kind of already down to one HP. Trying to approach with CADCs. Throws out Dragonite. Goes through the Dragonite with Poison Jab. Ooh, that bomb barely missing. I don't know, just trying to set up projectiles. working out quite well here. Sartag able to get the shift. Uh oh, Kano accidentally running into the tornado here. Throws out Victini. Yeah, be careful, that bomb's right there. Synergy activation, however, will get rid of the bomb. Throws out Yavatl, or Evil Tall. Is he going to combo into it? No, just barely missing. Throws Picano throwing out his burst, however. That is going to connect. Good amount of damage there. Those bubble things. They literally just follow you forever. They're stupid. <laughs> They don't act like any other projectile as far as homing properties. You could probably sidestep it to break the, the tracking. Uh, I haven't been able to test it. Yeah, a little bit of the RNG working out there. Able to get the, uh, I think that was counter tank. Gano able to get the uh, stun. A lot of damage here. And we're just in field. Able to get the shift. Able to get the counter attack. Throws out Dragonite. That is going to connect. Good use of the uh, Shadow Clones? I don't know enough about Darkrai. But his uh, clone there. Oh my gosh, alright. Clone there covered a little bit of range there. <laughs> and because of the double debuff, Sartag is going to be able to finish it with a grab. Because this, this character is stupid. <laughs> So, in case you aren't aware, Krogunk's properties to his attacks can change depending on the buff situations of either his opponent or himself. Um, if there are double buffs on Krogunk, he will do a ton of damage on a grab. A ton of damage. That was like 250. Um, and then if um, there's double debuffs, on, or it's like either one or two debuffs on your opponent, then it'll change one of his laser attacks. There's probably a few other things that I'm not aware of, but those are the two I've noticed so far. Anyway, Picano switching to breaks in here is main. 
A little bit of uh, projectile trading. Able to cover vulnerables with the uh, boomerang. No, no, he got the boulder. Able to get out of the corner. Ooh, just barely not getting him. Poison jab, getting those red armor frames will never make sense to me. Poison Sing, doing a lot of chip. Booty bump him into the debuff. Gets the grab, crit grab. A lot of damage there. And covers with the boomerang. Picano, taking round one. Alright, not able to counter through all of that. He's gonna get Tornado. But the Emolga is gonna connect, so a bit of trade. Kind of activating Synergy. Be able to punish. Just keep up the zoning game. Oh my gosh, this power! Sorry, Tag, activating Synergy. Goes Kano going for the burst. That is gonna get avoided. And he's gonna punish with his own burst. This is going to hurt, because Sorry Tag's got that attack up. Luckily, Picano does not have a defense down, otherwise it'd be even worse. A lot of damage there. Throws out Evil Tall. Ugh, gotta watch my pronunciations. A little blocking in time. Chipping down. Then we get the charged side beam to cover the uh, counterattack. Throws out a Molga. Going to accidentally run into it. And gets him with the side beam. Picano taking game two. <laughs> All right, so we are going to see a change. Alright, so sorry tag gonna switch to his shandy. <laughs> Tries to start with a round start laser, kinda of able to lock in time. Able to get the boomerang. Tries to go for a flamethrower thinking he'd hop. Gotta be careful, because there's Hex Bacano reacting in time. JX. Not able to combo off it. Able to block against the overheat in time. Throws out the side beam. Chipping down. Nice pressure here from Bacano. Goes for the chip setup with fire spin. Able to counter against it. Good timing here. Gets the flamethrower. Double flamethrower. Good hop through it and counter through it again. Kano bringing a fierce game right here. Able to avoid the laser. Activate synergy to uh, avoid the Beyblade. Ooh, Sartag will be able to get that. He's got to be careful with his approaching. Alright, Picano activating Synergy. I don't know. He'll be able to block in time. JX is going to land, able to combo off of it, throw him in the corner. No! Finnegan as well. Tries to go for a grab. JX is going to beat that out, crit against it, a lot of damage. Tries to go for a hex. No, oh, all right. Picano tried to go for a fire spin, but sorry, Tag is going to be able to uh, net him with those attacks and call it good. Oh. Able to get the boomerang. Finnegan is going to connect. Not able to combo off it, though. Goes for the counter, caught a vulnerable. 
activates Synergy. Able to Ember him out of the air. Gets a crit grab. Throws it back to field. Keeping up the pressure. Able to counter through the slam. Goes for the burst attack. I think sorry attack jumped. Yep, able to avoid it. Oh, the, the overheat. Caught him that time. Shield looking a little crispy. Got to be careful. Gets a side beam. Throws out Finnegan. The activated smog with the boomerang. Sorry, attack going to activate burst. Oh, all right. Tried to go for boomerang. Sorry, tag expecting that and covers it with a laser. So sorry, tag is going to take it two one. All right, folks. 